Well, Glenda, as of now, students are expected back at EMU and here at U of M pretty soon. And we all know that students, well, they like to hang out and they like to party. However, with this new order in place, students may want to think twice. I think it makes sense because it's a huge issue. The Washtenaw County Health Department isn't playing around when it comes to preventing the spread of COVID-19, especially on college campuses. Partying um, without necessarily social distance or precautions to prevent the spread of illness at this point. So that's really the concern that we're trying to address. The County Health Department says they put the order in place with students arriving at U of M and EMU to start the fall semester. Hopefully this is somewhat of an in-between where there can be some gathering, but ideally with distance, with face coverings and not large gatherings. No more than 25 people can gather at outdoor events. That's down from 100. The order says indoor gatherings can remain at 10 or fewer. On the Facebook page of the Ann Arbor Police, they say they will be canvassing in teams working from noon to midnight, seven days a week, looking for people breaking the order. If you plan on disregarding the order, expect a knock at your door. You could also face a fine or even jail time. With many things with this type of order is really going to be one first of education and engagement. You know, making sure that folks know what the guidelines are and what they should be doing. People in Ann Arbor say it's a good idea, especially after seeing what's happening at other campuses around the country. I think we all have a responsibility uh, to ensure that the people that are most vulnerable are protected, and we know that people can walk around spreading it without even knowing they have it. It's an aggressive and strong move by the county, but students say it is what it is. 2020 is a write-off. I think this just whole year is going to be bad for most of us, and we just have to kind of wait it out, unfortunately. And this order went into effect today at 5 p.m. Health officials tell me that it will stay in effect until it's either rescinded or amended. Reporting live tonight in Ann Arbor, I'm Alan Campbell. Glenda, back to you.